Hey everyone, as always, Dylan Miller Prospecting, and it's Pay Dirt Bargain Hunt Part 2. That's right, bargain hunt time. This is where I'm trying to find used pay dirt on secondary markets and hoping to find a really good ROI by paying less than I should. In the last video, I overpaid and I pretty much got skunked. This time, I'm pretty sure I won't get a extremely high ROI but I am hoping for a higher ROI than I typically would get because this time I found a bag of pay dirt on Poshmark. That's right, the used clothing store Poshmark. And this time I got a bag of golden pay dirt, but I did do my research this time and this bag of pay dirt sells for $34.99 on the website Golden Pay Dirt. On Poshmark, I only paid $10 for it, plus $7.45 shipping. So I got it for essentially half price. Now, I don't know how good of a return I'm going to get on it, but I'm hoping for a better return than the last used bag of pay dirt I bought. So let's just flash up the description and go to the overhead. As you saw, a pretty basic description, but with Golden Pater, most of their description is just salesman's talk where they're telling you what you could find, not what you're guaranteed to find. So let's weigh this up, see if it is the two pounds. And it is two pounds, 14 ounces. Now, one thing I will say is when I received this from the seller on Poshmark, I was a little concerned because it wasn't in a typical golden pay dirt bag it is in a ziploc bag but if you see on the description they actually state that now that it might be in a ziploc bag so let's open this up now i am not going to classify this just because again this is not so much a review as it is me hunting for some good deals and hopefully some higher rois by buying used pay dirt So typical golden pay dirt, that orangey material you might be used to. I do see some organics in there. Let's check it to see if it does have any magnetite. Usually golden isn't very rich in magnetite. And as you can see, not very much in here. So I'm really curious to find out if this is a good deal or not. So let's go get some water, pan this out, and see what kind of gold we can find. So have my not so clean water, my pan, all the golden pay dirt here, and let's just get started and see if we can find some gold. Well, finished panning everything out as you saw, and that was some really easy pay dirt to go through, but we'll talk about that in a minute. For right now, let's show you the gold I found. And there we go. I won't say a nice pile, but it is a pile of gold. And there are a couple pieces in there that are larger than typical for golden pay dirt, so I'm guessing that would be the nuggets. I wouldn't call them a nugget, and I doubt 99% of people would call them nuggets, but if you're used to panning out golden pay dirt, I guess you could consider them nuggets. Now let's weigh this up, see how much it weighs. And again, there was no guarantee in this bag. So there you go, 0 0.155 grams of gold. And let's talk about pay dirt difficulty. Now for this bag from Golden Pater, I would say it was easy Pater to go through. 
there is very little black sands in it, maybe an ounce out of the entire almost three pounds of material, and all the gold is in the larger classification. You really won't find any minus 40 in golden pay dirt. So for a beginner, easy, advanced, easy, and an expert, definitely easy. And now let's get to the final ROI and see if this was a good deal or not. Well, finished calculating my ROI from this used bag of pay dirt off of Poshmark.com. Now, originally this bag was from Golden Pay Dirt and it was their two pound jackpot bag. Its original price was $34.99 with free shipping. I got it off of Poshmark.com, paid $10 plus $7.45 for shipping for a total cost right here of $17.45. Now the gold I recovered, again, right here, 0 0.155 grams. Gold spot on the date this bag was received was $57.24, making this gold worth $8.87, which gave me an ROI of 50.83%. Now, I know a lot of people might be saying that's not a good ROI, but that is a really good ROI from Golden Pay Dirt. If I would have paid the regular price of $34.99, this would have only been a 25.35% ROI. So I essentially doubled my ROI, but I did pay almost exactly half of what I should have paid. So is it a good deal? Probably not, and I would never still recommend buying gold in pay dirt, but it was really fun hunting down some used pay dirt, and there was a chance I could have gotten a higher ROI than just 50%. But 50% is much better than 25%. So I'm pretty happy with this one. And now all that's left is to give away a 24 karat gold plated dime. And that's going to go to Bob Can See. So Bob Can See, make sure you email me so I can send this off to you. And to everyone else, thanks for watching. Happy panning. And if you're not already a subscriber, make sure you hit the subscribe button below.